Hey there guys, welcome back to Let's Play Tales of Sexteria. In our last episode, we confronted Maven and told him that our answer after viewing the Earthian story about the, the life of the last shepherd, Michael, and how Heldoth became the Lord of how it truly became the Lord of Calamity. <coughs> anyway, we confronted Maven and told him and Sarai told him his answer that he actually wants to save Heldoth, regardless of his wrongdoings. He wants to save him as the true duty of a shepherd. Now not to simply just not simply to quote unquote quell the Lord, Lord of Calamity. So now we're going to Elysia. But unfortunately, it seemed like war is on the rise. So we're going to have to actually go back to the Roland's army outpost because we're on this side of the um, continent. So yeah, we're going to have to go back. I'll take that later. So I guess we'll go back to Lasting Bell, I suppose. I wonder if Sergei's here. Well, we just have to see. Oh, you know, you know now I think about it, I could have just tell Hope and Boy to, to, to the basin. Now that I think about it. Uh, yeah. We have the wind step, so it shouldn't take that long. My one step. I don't want to get into any fights, so. Do do do. No, I refuse. Thank you very much. We can't have a war happen again. I mean, this is exactly what held off once. As much malevolence as possible. We can't possibly have that happen. Possibly. Okay, I wonder if Sergei's here. Or well, you still have Pendragon. Pendragos. Good lord. This whole let's play, I haven't been able to pronounce that name right. Yeah. Anyway. <sighs> Reporting casualties for the Blue Tempest Knights. 118 wounded, 30 dead. Whoa. Report. Approximately 50 casualties on the enemy side. Is it over already? Don't kid yourself. It's no more than a skirmish along the front lines. Yeah, the true boys yet to be gone. armies were clashing full on. <coughs> the count wouldn't be anywhere near this low. Yeah, exactly. This low. Oh, right. Where are the platinum knights? Sorry, not really accustomed to war. Sir. Yeah, me clear. To evacuate Lastenbell. Can't they see <coughs> there's no time? Saray, there's no point in just staying here. The Platinum Knights are in Lastenbell. Let's go see Sergey. Yeah. All right. Considering we just came from there, we gotta go back. I'll probably just teleport there. Honestly, I don't really care about the money. Oh, if you haven't realized, I got like a crap ton of money, so I'm good. <laughs> But other than that, that's really war. I mean, even over 100 knights are either dead or seriously hurt. That's actually a low number comparatively to an actual war. The death count will be a lot higher than that. And wait a minute. The sparrow feathers? Boss! Talfrin, what happened? We were all. <clears throat> Captured in Pendrago. They said we murdered the Cardinal. At the behest of the Kingdom of Highland. <laughs> what? But I was the one who... It was Lunar. He approached the Empire and suggested they frame it this way. Of course. The Empire was just itching for a justification to launch a war. If they could tell the world that Highland had assassinated their Cardinal... Almost too perfect. Yeah. Lunar laid an ambush for us. If Vigil hadn't shielded me, I would have... Shielded you? I'm sorry. I couldn't do anything but run away. We knew this might happen sooner or later. Part of the job description. But still... Rose, you should go. 
But we have to stop the war. We all know what they'll do now that they've trumped up a justification. Dispose of the evidence. You can't leave them like that, can you? After all, they're your family. You said it yourself, didn't you? You and I have two very different jobs. Thank you. I'll be back. Sure, go ahead and divide our forces in half. What about us? Oh, whatever. Should we be rescuing the scattered bones or stopping this war? Both are vital, but we can't be in two places at once. Well, yeah. Sergei's in Lastenbell. Alicia's probably at the Highland Army base. I, 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 then... <sighs> So, if I remember correctly, wasn't there some kind of cave or something leading to Highland around here? Right, the Lamarack Cave. All right. Oh, don't worry about that. Time free. Now, at this point, as you see on top right, we have three objectives, and you can tackle these three in any order as you want to. Uh, I think. Well, since we're in Highland, I guess. No, since we're already in, in the area of Lassenbell, I guess I'll take that on. Or go to Pentargo and help out Rose. Okay, you know what? Let's go to Highland. Because, well, it's no surprise, but there's going to be a boss fight there. What? Should I even go? I think out of all, all three of these have boss fights in it. Um, the one I'm afraid of most is High. Uh, <laughs> The one who can go to go help out Alicia. Alicia. Uh, what do I want to choose? I think I'll go. Yeah, we'll go and help out Alicia. <laughs> yeah, get this boss out the way. This spar this boss sparse. This boss scares me a lot. Can I teleport? Or do I have to go through the cave? I can. I think I can. Oh yeah. Sweet. Yeah, I guess we'll help out Alicia first. Yeah, I haven't seen Alicia in a good while. So this could be fun, I suppose. <laughs> you wouldn't know we're in the verge of war again. I guess fun is the last thing you would want to think about. Alicia. Oh wait, 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 wait! I'm, I'm, I'm being stupid. Apparently, we gotta go to the Alpos first before we meet Alicia. That's where we gotta meet Alicia first. <laughs> oh Lord, I'm, I'm getting too far ahead of myself. Apparently, now obviously, if we're on in here in Highland, we know. Rose is here, and also you can also know Meltran is here as well. If that makes sense, that kind of sound redundant. And we know Meltran is working for. Oh yeah, this is one of the Guardian Shepherds we were supposed to talk to. Okay, yeah, we'll talk to the other Shepherds later. Oh, not Shepherds, <laughs> Seraphim. Yeah, let's go to here. If we can find it, if we can find the area. Oh, it's a feel, it's a feel, feel. My bad. I'm not paying attention, really. Was it in Mel Marlin? I think it was in Marlin. Yeah, it was in Marlin. Yeah, here it is. Now we gotta go to the basin through here. Ah, yeah, this doesn't seem like the place we need to go, surely. Prepare for the assault. Once we 
receive the royal order, our entire forces will destroy the Roland's army. Ah, oh, they went right through me. Maltrin. This is exactly what you want, isn't it? It's you and Heldorf. But before I can go and pretty much interrogate you and confront you, we need to get treasure chests. And I think there's a no man right here too, and point interest apparently. Uh, where is it? Sorry. Can I get past there finally? No, I cannot. Why, game? Why? Ah, uh, Lord. I think there's a no man here. I know there's a nor a Norman around here. Or am I thinking about the wrong thing? Because I'm pretty sure Edna or Lila would have detected it by now. I guess not. I guess I I missed it in my last playthrough, and got it this time. All right, Maltrin. My my, Shepherd Saray. Welcome to our base. Perfect. We are moments from receiving the royal order authorizing our assault. And the messenger will be an old friend of yours. Alicia? You can't mean... You're making Alicia do that? It's cruel of Bartlow, but still an ingenious plan. If she brings the order, the war is on. And should she refuse, he can have her court-martialed for treason. I can only imagine her dismay. You disgust me. Will you attack me? Please, be my guest. Then I could reasonably claim that spies from Rollins were in our camp. No need to wait for a royal order. Mm. <sighs> Looks like the odds are stacked against us. Fortunately, we're going to need Alicia's help Unfortunately. to hold back the army. Alicia, is it? Go ahead and try then. I'm very curious. Well, we will. Well, then we will. Just you wait, Maltrin. I still can't go with the best there. What the heck? All right, now we got to get, get, go back to Alicia's Inn or Manor. Which I can't do apparently. I pray to God I don't have to walk all the way back. I think I do. Come on, give me a new pair of shoes, game. Give Mama a new pair of shoes. No, I'm gonna have to freaking walk back there. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Why couldn't we get an airship? Alicia wasn't at the army base. Let's check over at Lady Lake. But if we get Alicia involved, we'll have no choice but to tell her that Maltran is a Hellion. Yeah, that's nice. I'm, She'd be hurt for sure. I'm getting, I'm, I'm getting. Aware, but there's no other choice. <clears throat> Saray, look carefully at the ground. I heard tells of graces. I mean, not like good graces. Tells of hearts are. You have an airship. I've. I, I don't know if it's a side quest or not. I kind of restarted it because I knew I missed like a crap ton of side quests. I don't know how close I was to the end of the game. I just said, screw it. Just, just I'm starting over and doing all the side quests. Please, somebody can teleport. Come on. I, di I can. Yada. Yada. I don't know why I keep teleporting to the end, too. Oh Lord, you hear all those rumors. They even want the shepherd to be be involved in this, as he was in the last war. The last time the Rollins and Highland had had to do battle, and oh Lord, what's going on? How dare you obstruct our glorious battle! You're a disgrace to Highland. What's gotten into you, Alicia? <laughs> and this is our first time hearing the the, the the third version of ballad music. A lot more fast paced than the other ones. Alright. I wanna see if I does shut anything still. No, I don't. Yeah. Sweetness. How's that? 
Oh, Alicia, now she can fight against the Hillians. Let's do it. Hmm. Yeah, we can talk later. Take it down. All right, we can get this. Aha. And that's more or less what brought us here. I see. Zavid always talks about himself. <laughs> we'll fill her in later. <laughs> yeah. Why were those soldiers attacking you? Probably because I've been stalling the war. I have yet to deliver the royal order authorizing our attack. I expect they that. and resent you that much? You can see for yourself. There's not a thing in the world that can prevent this war now. You're giving up? What else can I do? What else do you expect me to do? The king has commanded that we launch an attack on Rollins. An official royal order has already been issued. If that dumb piece of paper's causing you all that grief, why don't you just chuck it? Just chuck it? Yeah. What exactly do you mean by chuck it? Chuck it. Just what I said. Tear up the damn thing like it never existed. I can't. You can't expect Alicia to do something like that. Hey, no pressure. I don't mind seeing her beautiful face all scrunched up in pain. Those are yeah. yeah, I mean, Alicia certainly has a lot on her mind. That much is sure. Saray, I think perhaps the only way to stop this war is to do as Zavid suggested. Would you be willing to assist me in this? Are you sure about this? You would be rebelling against your own country. I know the risks. All right. Of course I'll help you. Well, if Alicia's made up Just her like mind, old times. we can't refuse her, can we? Zavid, may I trust you in this matter as well? I can't decline a heroic princess. <laughs> Your of face looks better with a smile on it anyway. One ray of hope is that Lady Maltran is the one commanding our army. Oh, yes, She's right. She's bound to cooperate with us. Um, yeah, about that. What's wrong? I hate to tell you this, but Maltran's not going to help you. She's a Hellion. There we go. Thank you, Edna. She needed to hear she that. She serves the Lord of Calamity. She was the one pushing for war in the first place. Edna! We had to tell her at some point. Yeah, better she hear it now than get stabbed in the back later. That can't be true! Don't you even dare joke about such a thing! Unfortunately, not Alicia, joking. please calm down. No, Lady Maltran. She always encouraged me, even when... I apologize. I will see Lady Maltran and verify this for myself. Um, Back to that scrunched up face of hers. Thank you, Anna. Thank you so much. Uh, <laughs> uh, well, she does have a point, though. We're going to have to tell her at some point. Anyway, we have Alicia in the party. Yes, it's been quite a while since we had our favorite, our favorite Highland princess with us. Let's put her back with everything she had on before. Before I do that for some reason. There we go. So, yep, Alicia's back with us. Now, I think her equipment's pretty... Yeah, she got a bit of an amped up in terms of her armor. Or her, her, her equipment. So, yeah, she'll be good. <sighs> Alright. Really, there he is. There's Alicia. That's the first time seeing Alicia run so fast with this. <laughs> with the wind step. The power of wind. There may be some herbs out here. Be on the lookout for them. Yes, sir. I would just teleport to the area. Unless something else is going hey, on. Are your eyes okay? Alright. 
It's <coughs> fine. My vision's good. Oh, good. So that means you've become stronger. Just a little bit blurry is all. A little bit? That could cost you your life in battle. Um. Perhaps. But this is something you need to see through. To the end. Well, I... We've got way more important things to worry about. Saray needs you. Nothing will change that. Let's go, Alicia. Okay. Yeah, funny how, how if he's a former pet with, uh, with Rose, he's fine, but with Alicia, not so much. Yeah. Bunny and whoa, whoa, what was up with you? <laughs> Isn't there a way to like, have all three of them? I mean, you have four Seraphim. Seriously. Uh, I, 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 I don't know. Alright. Uh, so we can't travel. What a surprise. Alright. <laughs> I guess we're going to have to walk all the way there. Jesus. Well, the good news is we're actually running at the maximum speed right now. Well, I wouldn't say this maximum speed, more like this is one of the faster tiers. So I'm gonna have to freaking walk all the way back, right? Or run back. And that's kind of a hump game. You can't tell we're now. No, I cannot. Oh wait, you know that actually doesn't want to make more sense. There's gonna be an event. I think that's gonna be an event when we get to to the post. So I guess that makes some sort of sense. I'm actually gonna fight you mainly because I need this. One step. Hurry up. There you go. Jesus. Yeah, it's been a while since we fought with Alicia. That's a cool looking spear too. Not gonna lie. Toughened up a bit yourself. Yes, I've been undergoing intensive training. Under Lady Natrin. Mm. Oh, I see. Yeah, that's a little awkward. I did it! I was fighting it! Everyone okay? Of course. Can I wish you say that, Mr. Art, the little later <laughs> because we're gonna need that like you're gonna seriously need that actually now that I think about it I think I bought like a crap ton of arcane bottles when I was training yeah 15 of those I'm gonna freaking use them in battle where's that freaking scroll up here I know I heard his voice I <laughs> heard him scary out there he is unfortunately can't use them outside of battle which kind of sucks I finished preparing the gel. Oh, holy crap, I, I forgot about that too. <laughs> she ain't like anything else, is she? No. Unfortunately not. And we have made it. And hey, there's Meltran. Milady. So, you finally figured out who I really am. Why? For the ideals I cherish most. Now, messenger, the royal order, if you please. We have a war to start. <sighs> then I'll take it by force. <coughs> this way, too many prying eyes out here. I don't know why they kind of remind me of Dragon Ball Z, or where they would just say, "You know what? We're gonna, we're gonna fight to the possible death. In this case, to the death, but we'll do it at this specific location." <laughs> I 
Alright, so I guess we're going to go there. I think, I think it makes shortcuts. How could she? Alicia. Oh, Alicia. Yeah, we're fine. If you remember, this forest isn't really particularly big, so it's all good. <laughs> I'm not looking forward to this boss. Lila, what type of Hellion is Maltran? I, I honestly cannot tell you for sure. Well, that was useful. So all we know is she's one to watch out for, huh? A yes, strong, very much. Lady. I'm not seeing the downsides myself. Zavi, <laughs> if only you knew what her capabilities. Like seriously, she she freaking scares me. I'm not gonna lie. She, I'm l l seriously terrified right now of her. I'm not lying. <laughs> I probably always exaggerate this, but oh lord, she is so tough. Uh. Uh, defense. Give me as much defense as possible. <sighs> okay. <laughs> Alright. I'm feeling the same way like I did with the female assassin. We found out later it's Rose. I am not looking forward to this boss. I really am not. <laughs> okay. Enough law gagging. Let's just do it. Let's see what Alicia has to say. <laughs> Any last words, Alicia? Um. Alright. Let's just do this. Jewel effect. Alright. Now, hey, is that spear? Wait, no, she got, got a sword. I guess she made it into a spear. About this. I have other work to attend to. <clears throat> why, Lady Maltran, why? You are disgracefully slow to catch on. <sighs> what you see before you is reality and truth. One who cannot accept reality for what it is has no hope of being a leader to the people. I acknowledge my lack of resolve, but... Then you should have realized by now that your naive ideals have no meaning whatsoever in this present state of affairs. No surprise she's willing to spear to since she taught Alicia how to not fight. To the citizenry, certainly not to me. Then, then why did you act so encouraging and supportive to me all this time? Because you serve two vital functions. One of which was your utility in getting Highland and Rollins to finally clash with their full military might. Your incessant whining was just the thing to provoke Bartlow and the others to action. Uh, uh. Alicia's ideals do hold meaning and value. That's right. Saray believes in her, even if you don't. And he isn't the only one. I'm giving my dear pupil her final lesson. Kindly stay out of this. What, you can't deal with reality and truth? So many empty words. Who's slow to catch on now? A fair point. No need to exchange words when blows will suffice. For your other vital function. Stand back, Alicia! Mm. Alicia. Let's do it. All right. All right, we have Meltrin. Uh, I remember this boss very, very well. Lady <laughs> Meltrin was forever my ideal for who I wish to become. How could, how could this happen? Alicia, I think you know better than anyone how much caution we need. We can't do her without your help. Yes, well, Meltrin, she uses the same arts as Alicia. Now, the reason why she's so freaking tough because you can't seem to stun her, and when she's in a combo, she will combo you to hell and back. All right. Ah! Sorry, sorry! Alright, I'm gonna tie the wrong person, too. See? That's how freaking hard it is to stun her. Get away from me! <laughs> Get away from me! My best thing is to have her go towards me. Need a hand here. Do it! Always on the fence, everyone. We're gonna need it. Oh, 
Here for Alicia. Charge! Do it! <clears throat> Alright, we almost got her. 7,000 more. That is not a good number to have right now. <laughs> oh, Lord. That is not a good number to have right now. Did you have a little less than that, Maltron? I'm just saying. Um, at least if we can use actually Is this suicide? Nah. Ah Mr. Art. Thank you, Marvel Curry Bun. You're saving me from death. And delivering it too. Oh, there we go. Got past it. Got past her. <clears throat> that was a tough boss. It's not working. Uh, I'm not letting you purify me. What truly needs purification is this entire world. Please, Lady Maltran, stop! You are just being deceived by the Lord of Calamity! You're soft to the core, aren't you? Of all your flaws, that might be. <laughs> what I hate about you the most. <gasps> this is reality, Alicia. I have proven my dedication to my lord. I have no regrets. Alicia. <laughs> Alicia! <sighs> Let's go after her. Yeah, Alicia. Alicia. I can't do this. say that I've tried so hard for everyone <laughs> what good did it do and <laughs> still I they need you Alicia and yet you still want to stop the war right I feel just like you in a lot of ways the strength of a knight exists to protect. Their kindness serves the people. Lady Maltran's words still linger in my ears. I know she undoubtedly meant nothing by it. Just some pretty nonsense to lead me on. Maybe. But even if she did, you took those words to heart, didn't you? And the Alicia standing right here is as real as it gets. You can count on it. <laughs> I'm 
sorry you had to see this side of my reality. Oh, don't worry about it. Let me see what I can do about the Highland Army. I'm naive and soft and whiny enough to think it'll work. That's just who I am. And that's the Alicia that I like. Young folks, always with the melodrama. Sorry about that. What? Are you crying too? It's so beautiful. You say something? Nothing. Nothing. <laughs> oh, Lord. 